This is Prespa Lake. Not many lakes in Europe are shared by three countries, but Prespa is divided between Albania, the former Yugoslav Republic of Macedonia and Greece. Unfortunately, the natural flow of the lake is blocked because the border, a rare leftover from the Cold War, is closed, hampering economic development in the region. Local inhabitants now believe progress in Macedonian Greek negotiations on solving the name issue will bring about the reopening of the border. Here it's a dead end. People have left the place. The young have migrated elsewhere. I think we're forgotten by everybody, even God himself. If this border opens, then there will be some kind of movement of people. Even though there are not many left in the other part as well, the place will become more animated. A huge problem that especially Prespa has with the uh, uh, young people they, they, they leave the country. Uh, we would, we hope that it would be uh, different. The young people, more opportunity, they would give, more, give them more opportunity to, to open something for living and it would be very uh, useful. It's a 180-kilometre drive to reach the first inhabited place on the other side of the border, the village of Adios Germanos. This village is facing big challenges given the current economic crisis in Greece. Nikos runs a restaurant in the village and believes the opening of the border will increase opportunities. Prespa can be in three parts. It's lake. You can stop the water moving. You can stop the, the air moving. Why we have to stop the people moving? in the places yeah. in Sada. I think it will be good for everybody, but I'm afraid that the first years, the first years, two, three years, it will be difficult for us, for them, for both, until we, we will find our balance yeah. and to see how it will be work this for everybody. But if we are collaborated together, it will be better and sooner Better for all. This border, which is remained from the Cold War, finally has a chance to be open as a result of the talks between Greece and Macedonia for finding solution for the long-standing dispute over the name, which could open the European perspective for the whole region. At Prespa Lake for Euronews, Borian Jovanovski.